The population increase and poor surveillance systems are some of the challenges that have contributed greatly to the escalating cases of diseases in Uganda. Experts from the African field of epidemiology network advise government to invest more in the health sensitization programs. That Uganda's current population stands at 34.5 million people showing a growth rate of 6.5 percent every year. This poses a threat to experts and planners of this country because in the next 10 years the available resources will be overstretched. According to David Mukanga, the executive director of African Field Epidemiology Network, AFINET, the rapid population increase partly gives an account to the ever-increasing disease outbreaks. If you, if you used to get, if a village had a certain point of source for water, if the numbers have increased, start finding alternative sources of water, which may not be safe. So that predisposes them uh, to certain conditions. Some are just hygiene and so forth, so the, 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 the water-related ones. But also, adds that the past 20 years or so minimized the cases of human beings encroaching on forests, but due to the fact that of late human beings have come in close contact with strange wild animals, the spread of disease too has increased. Those forests have animals, and this, this is the condition we talk about that goes from animals to humans and, and back away them and, and, and the other way around. So as humans get in touch with the wildlife, that put, puts them at risk increasingly. It puts them at risk. So Our surveillance systems from government and the concerned parties are also to blame for the rapid spread of diseases in the country. When it was poor, there are things that happen and they are undetected because we just missed it. Not that it was not happening, but we missed it. So when the ability to see something, our ability to pick up things improves, then we pick up things and it appears as if things are happening more frequently. But they're probably already happening, but we're not picking them up as well as we are now. To find a way out of these challenges facing the Ugandan population, Mokanga advises government to invest more in sensitization programs geared towards reducing population growth. With over one million babies said to be born every year in the country, Uganda's population is expected to be 100 million by 2050. And the effect this can have to the environment and the weight of the burden on side of government in fighting diseases is expected to be many folds. Chris Semakula compiled this report for Record TV.